Morning, Stewie. Day four on the Ridgeway. Sound like you're aching. And we're heading up there to get back on the trail. All packed away. We're back on the trail. Mr. Brown. Bit more history today, I think, Brownie. Bedlow Cross. Yeah, there's a couple of barrows coming up. Pulpit Hill. Yeah. That was another one of them ditches, look. Hmm. Let's go check it out. Check us as well. Prime Minister's weekend retreat. Two hundred meters up on the top of Lodge Hill. Absolutely beautiful views over the Chilterns. What's that bird of prey, Stuart? Is that another kite? Oh, that is, because there's a sign back there. The red kite, is that right? Yeah, they're everywhere, aren't they? Wow. Was that at the pub yesterday, still yeah, in the pizzas? Yeah. <laughs> so we was at the pub at, uh, was it Watchlington? Yeah. The Spire and Spoke? And they yeah. serve lovely pizzas. But it's quite funny, because these kite bergs were, were swooping down, stealing pizza, causing chaos. Beautiful stop at Prince's Risborough into Costa Coffee. Both feeling good. Back on the trail now. Coming up next is Brush Hill and White Leaf Barrow. Yeah, that's where we go up there. Up this way. Welcome to Brush Hill. We're up here. Quite steep, weren't it? Coming up next is White Leaf Cross and White Leaf Barrow. Thank you, cheers. We 
seem to have missed uh, the white leaf cross and uh, the barrow. God knows where they were, but we did have a nice view looking back down onto Princess Risborough. We're now cracking on. There's um, Pulpit Hill Fort coming up shortly, and then we pass the entrance to uh, Checkers. Might catch Boris Johnson out for a run in the morning. Beautiful. Wow. So we've now reached the Checkers estate, and that house down there, which this camera probably can't pick up, is Checkers. Tell them what it is. Well, it's the weekend retreat for the Prime Minister. This rail is quite impressive. Massive estate, isn't it? Bit of a clearer view of Checkers. Behind it and up the top is a monument, Coombe Hill Monument. We're going to have to walk all the way around the Checkers estate and up there to get to it. Images are being monitored and recorded for security. We're going to crack on though. Pretty sweet monument that was, Mr. Brown, wasn't it? It was the best. Awesome. Thing. Quality. So now we've got one and a half miles down into Wendover, somewhere for lunch. Let's get walking. Shall we? On the trail, about 10 11 miles left now. Let's do it.
Final few miles to go, but I've lost Stuart. I don't know where he's gone. He's gone marching ahead, I know that much. God knows why. Let's see if I can catch him up. About four miles to uh, Ivanhoe Beacon, the finish point. Beacon Hill is in sight. I've caught up Mr. Brown, dumped his bag in his car, going bareback for the last couple of miles or so. We shall soon be at the end on top of Beacon Hill. Come on, here we go. Last five minutes or so. Let's do it, Brownie. Ivanhoe Beacon is an ancient signal point which was used in times of crisis to send messages across long distances. It is also the site of an early Iron Age hill fort. Archaeological evidence has revealed human activity dating back to the Bronze Age. And then it dawned on us. Our journey along the Ridgeway had come to an end. Four glorious days following passage of time. As always, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll see you in the next one. See you in the next one.